Jesus kneeled down and pray. Pray that ye enter not into temptation. Luke 4, 1-12, And Jesus being full of the Holy Ghost returned from Jordan, and was led by the Spirit into the wilderness. And the devil said unto him, If thou be the Son of God, command this stone that it be made bread. And Jesus answered him, saying, It is written, That man shall not live by bread alone, but by every word of God. And the devil, taking him up into an high mountain, showed unto him all the kingdoms of the world in a moment of time. And the devil said unto him, All this power will I give thee, and the glory of them, for that is delivered unto me, and to whomsoever I will I give it. If thou therefore wilt worship me, all shall be thine. And Jesus answered and said unto him, Get thee behind me, Satan, for it is written, Thou shalt worship the Lord thy God, and him only shalt thou serve. And he brought him to Jerusalem, and set him on a pinnacle of the temple, and said unto him, If thou be the Son of God, cast thyself down from hence. And Jesus answering said unto him, It is said, Thou shalt not tempt the Lord thy God. Luke 22, 40, 42, And when he was at the place, Jesus said unto them, Pray that ye enter not into temptation. And Jesus was withdrawn from him about a stone's cast, and kneeled down, and prayed, saying, Father, if thou be willing, remove this cup from me, nevertheless not my will, but thine, be done. Hebrews 3, 6, 12, But Christ is a son over his own house, whose house are we, if we hold fast the confidence and the rejoicing of the hope firm unto the end. Take heed, brethren, lest there be in any of you an evil heart of unbelief, in departing from the living God. 1 Corinthians 10 11, 14 Wherefore let him that thinketh he standeth take heed lest he fall. There hath no temptation taken you but such as is common to man. But God is faithful, who will not suffer you to be tempted above that ye are able, but will with the temptation also make a way to escape, that ye may be able to bear it. Wherefore, my dearly beloved, flee from idolatry. Revelation 2.13, 16, I know thy works, and where thou dwellest, even where Satan's seat is, and thou holdest fast my name, and hast not denied my faith, even in those days wherein Antipas was my faithful martyr, who was slain among you, where Satan dwelleth. But I have a few things against thee, because thou hast there them that hold the doctrine of Balaam, who taught Balak to cast a stumbling block before the children of Israel, to eat things sacrificed unto idols, and to commit fornication. So hast thou also them that hold the doctrine of the Nicolaitans, which thing I hate. Repent, or else I will come unto thee quickly, and will fight against them with the sword of my mouth.